As we were talking a little bit earlier, Wipeout is one of those shows where you don't know whether to laugh or feel bad for the people. I laugh. <laughs> <laughs> either way, yes, it's a great laugh. And either way, it's a good time. And there are new episodes tonight. <laughs> Joining us now to talk about it is one of the hosts and Connecticut native Camille Costick. Camille, thank you so much for being with us. <laughs> thank you. I'm so as soon as I heard Hartford in this lineup of, of this tour today, I was like, yes, my people. <laughs> well, we're excited, you know, and I, I, I hear that your love um, Gronkowski is in the Rob Gronkowski is in the background. And I just watched the interview to see how much you two really knew about each other. I was pretty impressed. He did a good job. Oh, what did you watch? Did you watch the GQ interview? Yes. And I also love that you said your mom is your inspiration. Yes. Yes. He said Tyra Banks. And I was like, you're right. You're close. But it's my mama. <laughs> That's all. All right, Camille, I got to be honest with you. I was going through a breakup. My life was terrible. My mother was visiting with me. She was keeping me sane. And the only thing we watched over and over again was Wipeout. And we laughed and laughed and laughed. Oh, that's awesome. This is the best show on television, and I'm so glad it's back, and I'm so glad you're the field host. Tell us what the experience is like. Oh my gosh, it's, I mean, it's, it's hilarious. It's fun, it's exciting. I go in every morning super early, and listen, I'm not a morning person, but as soon as I pull up to set and I see that my job is getting to walk out onto a big obstacle course in the middle of a ranch, it's electric. It's it's so exciting, and all the participants that come on. I mean, they're going through a, one of the biggest courses in America. For it, it's like a once in a lifetime opportunity, and I get to be one of those people to be front row and all of the action and tell the stories and commentate on, on their runs. And it's it's really exciting. I get really close to the contestants. There's a lot of laughter, but you're gonna see. I cry sometimes too. It's usually happy tears. Sometimes there's proposals. It's so much more than just writing the course. And uh, I have so much fun. It's it's really exhilarating every day. Oh my God. It's so awesome. I, I would, I, I feel like maybe you would want to do the course. Are you ever allowed to try it? Listen, I am a daredevil and I have been wanting to do this course <laughs> so bad. I actually, it's a funny story. When I actually got the job as one of the hosts of Wipeout, I called my little sister that I grew up watching the show with um, ever since I was, I was younger. And I was like, oh my gosh, I got it. I'm going on Wipeout. And she was like, well, who's your partner? And I was like, no, no, I'm not, I'm not running the course. I'm going to be <laughs> on every episode telling the stories of everyone running the course. But um, hopefully one day I can grab her and, and, and run it this time. Well, I think being the field host is better than being the other host because you are down there in the nitty gritty getting to talk. Where do these people come from? How do you audition for this show? And can we get on it? <laughs> You can absolutely get it. And I think that will, you know, it's like, how do we make the next interview better and better each time? It would be when you go on the show and then I could talk to you. We can all talk about what it was like because I don't know. I know as much as I see. I don't know what it's like to run the course. So I think you guys should definitely go on. I know some people. I don't know exactly <laughs> the casting process. It's one thing I don't know much about, but... You two have big personalities and are not afraid of the camera. You can crush it. Oh, my God. That's so awesome. I love it. <laughs> so we wipe out on the first try. Oh, totally. All right, Camille, you know, it's so cool that you grew up here in Connecticut. And I know you were a dancer. You ultimately went into become a Patriots cheerleader. I know there's lots of young girls watching like, wait, she grew up where I grew up. How do I do that? Like, what, is there someone who really influenced you or a place you trained or some advice you have for young people who are admiring you right now in Connecticut? Yeah, it, it, anything that you want to do. I mean, this job is so much fun for me because it's it's what little Camille has always wanted to do. You know, we, we all have that little kid inside of us that just, you know, wants to live life to the fullest. And I can't even believe that this is my job and that I get to talk about new episodes that the whole family can gather around the TV and just have so much fun watching. You know, I'm not handed a script when I go to work. I just get to meet people from all around the world who just want to have a good time and be big kids at heart. And listen, it's a lot of adults. It's a, actually a bunch of adults for the most part that run the course. So I, it's like a big, it's like a big playground for all of us and everyone enjoys watching it. It's why it came back um, after the long hiatus. And I'm very, very excited to be a part of the reboot. So um, yeah. All right. Now I, we know you're dating Rob and we think that's terrific, but what was it like to work with Ryan Reynolds? Another one of my crushes on free guy. I, I don't blame you. He is a, I have nothing bad to say. He is such a stand-up guy. Um, I was so nervous going into that audition. 
Um, Sean Levy is the director for the film. And I actually remember when I auditioned for the role, I was like, you know what? This is a great experience auditioning for this. Um, I'll know more going into the next one. And the way that they really believed in me um, was really incredible. I was so over the moon when I got the call that I had landed the role for Bombshell. And then getting to be on set and, and in Boston where I was living at the time, it was an incredible experience. Ryan is great. Sean is great. Uh, Laurel Howery is great. There's Jody Comer. Everyone was so awesome. Um, not only, you know, on set, but off set. And uh, yeah, you, I can confirm, continue to have him as a crush because he's a great guy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, we love you. We've got a crush on you. Oh, I love you guys. Connecticut forever. Always sticking to my roots. <laughs> All right. Never <laughs> stop dancing. Never not dancing. Never not dancing. All right. Never not dancing. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Take care, Camille.